guys i'm back today with another video this one is going to be brought to you by the company love me hair and today i'm going to be showcasing this short curly affordable wig this is what it looks like straight out of the package look at those curls they are super cute now this unit comes with two combs on the side a comb in the back and your adjustable strap and an elastic band Fit on this unit was good. I had no issues as far as the cap goes. The sides of it were fine. I didn't feel any uncomfortableness going on with those ear tabs. They did go in and pluck out the front of this hairline. There's a little track right there, but I also like how they put the hair over it. So if the wind blows back, it won't be noticeable. This is HD, so if you wanted to rock this glueless, you absolutely can. However, I'm going to go in with my Olive Oil Fix It Hole Spray just to kind of melt it down. Just making sure to press everything in with my rat tail comb because I don't like that lace to be rolled up in the front. And then I'm going to tie the front of the hairline down while I work on styling this hair. These curls are straight out of the box. So if you wanted to rock it and not run your fingers through the curls and cut your lace off, I think you will actually be good to go. But I'm going to comb through the hair because I want to see how the hair quality feels. And it felt really nice and soft. I didn't notice any kinks or any tangles going on. But I'm going to spray a little bit of water on the hair. Not too much. And then I'm going to go in with this TGIN Rose Water Mousse. This is my first time working with this, so I'm hoping it's good, but I'm just going to place a generous amount on the hair and I'm really going to focus towards the end. And yes, I did smell it because I like to smell my products and it had a very light scent to it. I was hoping it wasn't heavy because I didn't want to have to worry about a headache, but I'm going to run my fingers through this first and then I'll use my defining brush to clump the curls together. me any time to put that product in and define these curls look at that it's looking good so far so now i'm just going to place my diffuser on and get to drying this beauty I diffuse the rest off of camera because of course <laughs> I don't want to bore y'all. That was going to take a while. So now that the curls are all nice and dried down, I'm going to remove this elastic band to see what that hairline is looking like. And yes, it is all laid down. You can barely see where that little track piece is. So that's good. Now this is the minimalist lace. So it is a six by four by one. And as you can see, it is a left side part. The knots are already come bleached, but I'm just going to add like a little bit of powder just to kind of open and brighten it up a bit more. There are a few pieces that I noticed that weren't as curly that looked a little bit too long. So I'm going to go and trim some of those pieces down. And then I'm going to place my Sleek and Shine Serum throughout this hair. I did notice like just a little bit of frizziness, not a lot of flyaways at the top. I had no issues with that. But of course, the more you fluff, then the more frizzy it'll get if you play around in the hair. In the front, I noticed an area that just was not curled at all. And I needed it to mimic a curl. I kept trying to tuck it. It wasn't working so what i'm going to do is take a little bit of mousse and i'm going to place it on the hair and then i'm going to twirl it around my finger so that it'll hold a curl and then i'll use the diffuser to dry that piece down mm -hmm. 
So this is the final look, y'all. The short curly style is super cute. It took no time to style this. This is definitely going to be an easy peasy type of unit. If you are a beginner and you want a curly unit, but you feel like you're gonna be intimidated by it, yeah. I like this one. Now this is 150% in density. And then also this is a natural black color, which you guys can clearly see it is a bit dark. But guys, make sure you stay tuned after this. So you can hear my final thoughts when it comes to this unit. Loving that this is a closure, but I also love how good the closure is looking like. Do y'all see that part in space? yeah that looks really good very simple and easy install i use a little bit of my olive oil spray to lay the lace down i didn't even go all the way across like there's still all this lace over here but it was going to be covered up so i said why um so i just sprayed a little bit on this side and as you can see this is pre-plugged but as you get closer to here not as plucked out but that's because they don't want you to run into that track but once i tie down my elastic band like it laid down really well i feel like it looks good they also did go in and bleach the knots on this unit so i just added a little bit of powder to the parting space i didn't put any powder in the hairline area because the lace blended so well into my skin one thing i like about this unit is that over here on the side it's laying down really flat you guys know with some closure units it can be really bulky and uncomfortable but no it's laying flat you can barely even see where the weft parting is i'm kind of moving it out the way so you can see it but i just took a little hair and kind of covered it up i didn't do any swoops today because i didn't feel like it was needed but i love how comfortable the cap is how everything is laying now the curls look really cute straight out of the package but i started kind of like messing with the curls so it was getting frizzy so i went in with this tgin rose water curl defining mousse this is my first time using this and so far so good um, i like that it's not super sticky on my fingers and i just added a little bit of water and i put that product on the hair and i used my defining brush and the curls just kind of clumped up together. I used my diffuser and it didn't take me any time to diffuse this hair down. Now I did notice there were some like longer pieces that I had to cut off, but not too many of them. Most of it was on the side. When I turned around, I feel like it looked really good. 150% in density. I do feel like this hair is really nice and full. I didn't feel any thinness in the crown area. When I turned around, you can see how nice and full it is also. Um, they do offer this in 8 and 10 inches. I like this length. I could even go like a little bit longer, but I think that this is cute, especially if you want something really short and curly, but you don't want to spend too much money, but you still you still want this to look very very realistic as far as shedding and tangling goes i got a very little amount of shedding and then tangles i'm not receiving any at this moment but you guys know with my curly units i don't run my fingers through it but because this is so short i don't see you really having an issue um in the nape area now i know this length you know it's not gonna be for everybody because some people like their curly units to be a little bit shorter but i think she's cute if you want some curls but you don't want a lot of high maintenance too because the curls on this are really nice and soft i did notice some frizziness going on and then right up in this area some of the pieces were straight so i had to finger pull this and then cut down those little scraggly ends but that's it i noticed more companies are doing like this type of closure and i think that is cute but i will like the option to do a left or a right side part i prefer right side parting but i'm okay with the left side part too it'll be great for ladies who do not care to switch up their parting space like they are dedicated to that side for me i'm either gonna rock a middle part or a right side part it really just depends on the particular style this, if you are feeling this unit i am gonna make sure to leave all the links down below in the description area guys do not forget to subscribe to my channel turn those notifications on share and like this video and i'll see you guys next time bye guys <laughs>